beside the kitchen over here is their gym. So completo rin yung gym niya with all the lahat ng ano, weights. You have a Pilates section also. You have a uh, treadmill. And this is a pre-core, uh, I don't know what you call this, uh, stepper. And of course, the uh, gym machine then also. You have the machines also. So, you pra practically don't have to go out. Ganda, no? Anyway, this goes to their uh, back kitchen and all that. From the back, this is how it looks. You can see na all glass sa taas. So there's no lack of sunlight or or uh, lighting from the outside to the house. Now, before we go upstairs, I'd like to show you the basement parking. So we're going down the basement parking through the elevator. Uh, pinakita ko sa inyo yung uh, basement parking, yung driveway going to the basement parking. So now we are going to the basement parking from coming from the inside para makita niyo yung basement parking. We're using the elevator and this elevator is a home elevator. So this is a smaller version of yung mga sa commercial ones. Um, it's now more affordable so if you want to build one or put it in your house this is called the Viking Elevator maglagay ako ng link or address para if you want to put one in your house tawagan nyo sila ang ganda nung no? so I also show it from the outside when I step out we're already here at the basement yeah. See? So nice. So we are now here at the basement parking. This is an 11 car uh, car park uh, garage and it's very well thought thought out. Um nakaplano talaga lahat. So you can see all the cars are on just on one side. Um pagpasok mo sa driveway all on the right side sila. And then on the left side the left side there's two rooms one room which is actually the driver's quarters another room is lahat ng mga electrical and all that dyan nila ma-access lahat so yun nakatago lahat and then there's a generator's dulo which can actually power up the whole house kung may brown out and then on the left side pa hindi ko napakita there's a water tank because uh, they filter all their water para maging soft water and then also pag akyat um, filtered na ang water sa buong bahay this is the driveway going up and out may gate din dito para diretso ka na from the basement parking pwede ka na lumabas dyan and then they also have their storage areas uh, marami silang storage dito kasi we tend to uh, need a lot of storage in our houses uh, the door on the left side actually leads up uh, to the first to the ground floor, pero using the stairs. We are going up again using the elevator. So now we are going up to the second floor using the elevator, the Viking elevator. So we are coming up on the second floor. Uh, this elevator is at the end of the hallway, so when you open it up, you can see the whole hallway now. Um, the doors are leading to the bedrooms. Look at the dog, he's so cute. Papa belly rapa. Cute. 
So this is the hallway and as you can see on the left side is the same theme as the one at the kitchen, yung uh, wood niya. On the right side naman, false doors yan. It looks just like a wall pero mga, mga cabinets then where you can put in your uh, shoes and all that. So ganda pagka plano. And then, hindi na tayo papasok sa mga bedrooms nila because it's private but uh, we have a small office over here. Uh, it's like a library office. So, so nice. And then, uh, that's the, going to the bedroom. And another, I think that's the master's bedroom over there. And this is a massage chair with, uh, you know, if you want to watch something out, out here. Ogawa, which is uh, what I have also in the house. So, From here, you can see all the way down there. And that's the ground floor. So we'll go down on our way down. There's another room that I haven't showed you, that one. So these are bedrooms on the left and right. And we are going down. This is a uh, it's an area where we come to always. That's one of the paintings that I really like. It's from Ronald Ventura. Really, really nice. So ang ganda ng mga sculptures that he has. Also the paintings, also of course. And this is a powder room also for this area. Nice, diba? Para ka nasa hotel. But with a very homey feel. Okay guys, there's one thing I forgot to show you. We are going up to their roof deck and there's a high li height limit in the village so uh, hindi pwede na mas mataas ng two floors or three floors yung ano, bahay. So ang ginawa niya, open yung roof deck and this is the door. I'll show you the door. And sliding yung door niya to the roof deck. As you can see, see? Yeah, no? Just slide it open para makaakyat ka dito. Galing, di ba? And, nandito na rin yung solar panels na para hindi ganun kalakas sa kuryente. And all the air conditioning is here. Solar panels are here. Parang isang parang isang mall. <laughs> Yan. Galing, no? So from here you can see all the other houses. Uh, makikita mo eh para mga windows dyan. Those windows are actually for the uh, restrooms or CRs that they have. Uh, kasi wala silang windows dun. So ginawa niya ng windows dun sa taas. Very nicely done. So I hope you like this tour of, of the house. Uh, sorry, we can't show you the bedrooms because uh, private lang ayan and we don't want to um, Enroach on their privacy, pero I hope that uh, ito kasi is are one of those uh, houses that you can never see and di mo mapuntahan kung, uh, kung if we don't vlog it or no. Um, because these are private people and they don't really like to show their houses and who, who owns it. But 
they gave me the chance to blog this so I'm very very thankful uh, and um, maybe later on we'll show you other houses also but um, as of now this is one of the dream houses that I really like and uh, I wish we all wish that we could have so hope you enjoyed this tour um, I hope you uh, continue to follow and like and subscribe to all my vlogs and I'll see you soon again on one of my future vlogs. Thank you for watching.